The Highway Patrol is trying to find a hit and run driver responsible for the death of a man in Jackson County. We first reported that 22 year old Cole Preston was killed almost a week ago. Investigators are still looking for leads in that case. News 13's Frank Crocker joins us. Frank, the young man's family is also reaching out. We talked with Cole's grandmother tonight, a woman who suffers tremendous loss and would like to see some justice. Waterfalls, the rivers, the mountains, everything. I mean, he just fell in love with it. There's so much to remember about Cole Preston, the boy who grew up in Polk County, Francis McCain's one and only grandson. Now I have six beautiful granddaughters, but I, I don't have Cole. And that's hard. That's hard to take. It's hard to live with. Cole lost his life last Wednesday morning along Highway 107 at the Settlement Road intersection. Troopers don't know why his black Honda skidded off the road, but they do know he walked away from the wreck, back up to the pavement, and was hit there by another car, a driver who did not stop. I would hope they would man up and, and confess and, you know, turn themselves in. Beyond tragedy, Cole's family and friends pull together. There's a memorial Facebook page with hundreds of entries. These are pictures of a celebration of life held over the weekend. The images reflect Cole's free spirit, happiness, and love of the outdoors. And it was free flowing. And it was just, it was wonderful. It was very inspirational. It really was. He wanted people to live life and love life, you know, because he did. That's how Francis wants her grandson remembered, the kind young man who touched so many lives. The final tribute that day along the Pacolet River, Cole's kayak filled with flowers, set free. His dog Mowgli following close behind, just like always. It was a beautiful thing, though, to watch the kayak go down the river and then the dog jump right in and go after that kayak. He's still here with us. So. He's just walked into another room, that's all. Investigators are hoping someone will come forward to get this case resolved. If you can help, call the Highway Patrol Office in Clyde, the Jackson County Sheriff, or Crime Stoppers. Larry.